you know, your father was involved as a backup singer. Uh, Definitely. Dealing with the, with the Supremes. Yeah, um, for Mary Wilson, he used to sing backup and, and play. Actually, when my parents met, my mother was from Canada, my dad's from the U.S., and they kind of met one night when he was hanging out with Gladys Knight in the pits. Oh, he, nice. You know, he managed quite a few bands uh, in Detroit back in the day and everything. So I think that's where a little of the, the talent came from. He actually... Um, played guitar as well. Um, my mom was just like a big time music lover and my brother plays like 10 instruments. So um, there's definitely some something in the genes. So there, yeah, well, say. your voice definitely uh, incorporates the, the things that your mother has done, the things that your father has done. So in terms of what they've done, like you're, so your mother was also into the music, into the She arts. was just, uh, she always told me, you know, if I could sing, I would be the greatest singer. Because <laughs> she always yeah. loved, like, Motown. And yeah. Big things happening over here in the city. And speaking about big things, musically and everything inside the vibes, we have a special guest. And her name is Mrs. Faith Walker. She is here right now. And uh, we're going to talk to her in a few I'm going to open with a track right now, and this track that I'm going to be playing right now is a, well, this is, well, I'll call this the opener, okay, because uh, for those who uh, want to, to get that memory lane aspect of this, and the reason why I'm going to play this one first is it'll sort of bring you back to where, you know, the, 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 the homegrown R&B stuff comes from and so forth, so I'm going to play this track, and then once it rings a bell, we're going to go into the other tracks right now too, all right? So... Check this out. This is Faith Walker right here exclusively on 93.3 CFRU. I want people to, to hear it and embrace it. And I feel like, you know, I write all my own music and I really think that, um, you know, the songs that I write can affect people in a positive way. So that's important to me. So, yeah. you know, like you don't want to rush it. But at the same time, I said, you know what? Like I can get like six or seven solid songs out there. So I'll be dropping the first single um, off the EP February 14th, which okay, is great. Valentine's Day. So, nice, of course, nice. a little love song. Yes, yeah. yes. I got to make sure. Hey, Samantha, I hope you're hearing that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, Samantha, listen up. 